Alright, thank you for watching my video. Today we are going to flush the Dock 4 on the rear of a 2007 Yamaha R1. First thing we're going to do is remove the brake fluid cap. Next we're going to take our Mighty Back tool and we're going to suck the reservoir dry. With the reservoir empty, let's take a clean paper towel and let's clean out the inside of the reservoir. We want to get as much of that brown filth out of there. Unfortunately, the plastic's not that good anymore coming from China, so it discolors quickly on motorcycles. So we're going to top off the reservoir with new DOT4. We want to use DOT4 out of a sealed container. And then we're going to remove the rubber dust cover from the top of the bleeder nipple. We're then going to take our Mighty Vac and hook it up to that bleeder nipple and suck all the fluid in the line out. So we're going to go ahead and put our Mighty back on, get some suction going, and then break the valve free. And just suck the fluid right out of the line. We don't want to suck so much though that it drains the reservoir, so keep an eye on your reservoir and don't let it get below the low level line on the side of the reservoir can. Again, we're going to top off the reservoir with DOT4. And one more time, we're going to pull the clean brake fluid through the brake line. Do not let your brake fluid get below the low level line. So after you've pulled at least two reservoirs through your brake lines, your brake system is flushed out. You have new fluid in your entire system. So we're going to clean off any of the old fluid residue off the cap. We're going to top off the reservoir, only go to the full line. Don't go beyond full. And we're going to put the cap on. Make sure that your bleeder valve is tight and always, always, always put that dust cover back onto the valve. And then the last step you want to do always when you're doing any brakes, front or rear, is hit the lever a few times. Thanks for watching my video.